Right, I'm going to show you how to draw grid lines. If you look at the top of your screen, you'll see the little uh, um, drawing toolbar. If you click on that, it will show you at the bottom of your screen a drawing toolbar. Um, I'm going to drag it up here to the top so that I, you can see nicely what I'm doing. The first thing that I want to do is to display a grid. Make sure that snap objects to grid is ticked and snap objects to other objects. Uh, my grid settings, I want quite big blocks, so I'm going to make it one and one square blocks. You can set this any way you like. Um, display grid lines on screen, I'm going to tick that and I click on OK. Now I've got nice square blocks over here, but I don't want such a big grid and I'm just going to do a little one so that you can get the idea. Say for instance, I want there and very important at the moment it's a solid block I don't want a solid block I want it to be transparent so I click on my little tool icon um, in my drawing toolbar that says no fall and now I can see straight through it okay and now I'm just going to keep on drawing blocks horizontally and vertically I don't have to worry too much because it's going to to hook onto my corners in any case um, and remember to make each one of them transparent. Click on the rectangle, come on, click on, make sure that it's lit up and draw your block. Right, make it transparent. And uh, over here I can actually draw a line if I want to but I'm just going to draw a block again and make it transparent. I can also set my transparency as default. Now I'm going to do my horizontal lines. So over here, there we go, make it transparent. Over here, uh, there, that one there, and make it transparent. And draw over here, and make it transparent. There we go. And I can now go and switch off my grid, grid, tone display on screen, OK, come on, OK, there we go, if I click on it, there's my little grid. Um, I can now go and group them all together so that they don't go out of shape. So go back to your little drawing toolbar, oh, first thing you have to do is to choose there's a little arrow right next to draw and I'm just going to, to drag a box around everything over there. Now my all my lines and blocks are lit up and if I now go to draw and click on group I'll see that I'll have one, one block that I can drag wherever I feel like it.